Doris, Doris, both these teams very strong on the backboard. And that's about effort, right? There's got to be a willingness to mix it up physically, to be able to work hard. And, and you see teams that are not afraid to scrap and claw. Hey, that's how I play. I love rebounders. You did play that way, that's right. But you love rebounders, don't you? I, I do, because I think it takes commitment. You've got to continue to work. You know bodies are flying around in there. It's not for the faint of heart. Mm-mm, mm-mm. Look at Cleveland's starting group. Love and Thompson, the hard rebounding post pair. Sharpshooters Irving and J.R. Smith are the backcourt duo. And it's LeBron in its small forward. Up against Green. Pachulia dishes to Kirk. All three off the mark. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. Smith wide open. He fires. Yes, it's James picking up the assist. And really, Smith is always looking to fire as soon as he touches the ball. The D has to be more aware of that quick trigger. Curry against Irving. Pachulia kicks to Durant. Back to Pachulia. He feeds it to Durant. And there's the call on James. That is his first foul of the game. Here in the first, a little over a minute played so far. Three-pointer. And it's Stephen Curry with a three. Curry's got his first bucket of the game, and he's on the board for three. Cleveland's gone two or two from three-point range here in the first quarter. Smith against Thompson. LeBron passes to Smith. Launches a three. It's rebounded by Curry. Golden State's gone one or two from long range in the first quarter. Outside Green for the three. Gets it to go from beyond the arc. A lot of times in the first quarter, it will dictate how big a role a player has later on. And he's one of those guys who could step up and be a big-time contributor on certain nights. We'll see if that three gets him going. To the paint. That's tipped. Stolen by Thompson. Curry against Irving. And LeBron James gets it to go. I tell you, when LeBron is working near the rim, his strength becomes readily apparent. And the Cleveland Cavaliers winning the first title in franchise history, upsetting the favorites, the Golden State Warriors. First time ever a team returned from a 3-1 deficit in the finals to win. Smith outside. Cleveland moving the ball around. Launches a three. Irving can't get it to go. The Warriors have gone three of four from the field to start out the game. Outside Curry. Pass to Durant. Back to Curry. Outside for Durant. Inside. Five to shoot. And there's the whistle on the shot. Took the foul. Shot misses. He'll be shooting two. You know, respect and admiration around the league for how tough Pachulia is. His physicality means an awful lot to the squad. So what a season 2015-16 turned into for Zaza Pachulia. Acquired by Dallas for a heavily protected second-round pick, he filled that starting role admirably and was instrumental in helping the Mavericks make the playoffs. Hits it from three-point range. Oh, a good open look, and he sprays it home from three. And keeping us updated from the sideline, let's swing it over to David Aldridge. Hey, Kevin, I was able to talk with Teron Lou for just a minute. He said one of the challenges they face in this matchup is the shot blockers. He said we've got to use pump fakes and get their guys up in the air. Anything that helps us convert close in looks, or at the very least, get to the line. Kevin? Thanks for the report, David. You know, I, I think he's right to be concerned about the defense they're going up against today. I mean, it's going to take some creativity for them on offense to be able to score consistently. Yeah, I mean, the truth is, this is not going to be easy. They're facing a defense that prides itself on taking advantage of your miscues, so they really have to execute. And Pachulia nearly voted an all-star starter in the West last season. How about, Kev, a big social media movement drove a lot of the votes for him, and something he wasn't ever really involved in. Just shows how much people appreciate his game, though. Not a big numbers guy, but he impacts winning. 
They double team Kirk. And Pachulia with the dunk. Well, Pachulia just keeps pounding away. Terrific finish at the rim. 133 left here in the opening quarter. Smith outside. Love against Green. Smith kicks to James. And there's the call on Durant. That's his first foul. Different look here for the Warriors. David West, he's checked in for Pachulia. Iguodala comes in for Kevin Durant. Ian Clark's checked in for Thompson. And it's Livingston in for Steph Curry. And the Cavaliers will go with a different look here. Channing Fries checked in for Tristan Thompson. Jefferson comes in for Kevin Love. Mon Shepard's checked in for Smith. And Mo Williams subbed in for Irving. Jefferson, that's good. How about the passing? They are moving the ball without any thought, without any individual agenda. Here's Livingston, the dunk, and the foul, a powerhouse move, and he's got a chance for one more at the line. That's called on Channing Front. And the lead goes right back. What a seesaw affair we've got going on. I tell you, what a battle. Neither team giving an inch. The lead changing hands back and forth. Here's LeBron, and the rejection by Iguodala. Green up on top, covered by LeBron. Green dishes to Livingston. Marvelous lead pass, and he throws it down. And that is a major league flush right there, my friends. And in a tight contest like this, Greg, that might be just what they need to get the tide rolling in their direction. It couldn't have come at a better time. With the score being as close as it is, he had to make that play. The Cavaliers shooting their first free throws of the game on this trip to the line. And this Warriors team so dominant on so many levels. But but for me, what, what energizes them is, is that fluidity and that unselfishness of their offense. I mean, it's so much fun to play that way, and that joy feeds into every aspect of the game. Two open that time, made it with two easy. West just got himself on the board with three there. And both teams on fire from the opening tip. This crowd is already getting its money's worth. Now here's James. Seven points in the game. Beyond the arc. He can't get that one to fall. A free-flowing first quarter. Great scoring through one. Warriors ahead. They're up by five. The sky's the limit. And now the second quarter just getting set to start. And the Warriors, guys, what jumps out to you in this game, uh, stats-wise? And we've really seen them get out and establish a real nice rhythm offensively in this game. Well, I certainly like the play calling. They're keeping the defense guessing, and more importantly, they're generating points. And so in the game for the Cavaliers, it's Love and Fry, the sharp-shooting big man. Amon Shepard is out there with Mo Williams, and it's Dunleavy in at the three spot. To the wing right side. A three. No good. Shot missing. And Golden State will go the other way with it. Clark, the pass to Iguodala. Trying to find Durant. He's got it now. But the, the feed inside has got to be perfectly placed. It nets him two points. That's nicely done. The Cavaliers trail by seven. Williams kicks to Dunleavy. And there's the pass to Love. And David West gets the whistle that time. That is his first foul of the game. Irving's checked in for Cleveland. Dishes it to Shumpert. Irving with the ball. Back to Shumpert. West with the block. Irving for three. Cleveland the rebound. Shumpert in the corner. From the arc, connects from three-point range. Shumpert's got himself going with the triple, his first basket of the game. Warriors leading by four. Now Livingston, he has five. Down low, off the pick. Back to Iguodala. Shot clock at six. Three-pointer. It's holding by Fry. What a great opportunity. Nice open look. You'll take those anytime you can get an uncontested shot. 
Yeah, you know, Channing Fry, guys, a guy acquired by Cleveland last season at the trade deadline. I think he's been crucial. The ability to space the court at either power forward or center and on a very reasonable contract. Bobbed up there for Durant. Oh, just a picture-perfect alley-oop. You, you got to love that one, A little surprise, Greg. He didn't go for the big slam, but it works just the same. The Cavaliers trail by six. Irving dishes to Love. Livingston passes to Clark. Irving with the steal. Out to the wing. Unlady kicks to Irving. It's blocked. And now here's Durant. The best breakup of the oh, bench. Yeah. Get out of the way. Such a strong finisher on the fast break. Yeah, and he's not going to let an opportunity like that get away. I mean, he's just going to go hard to the bucket. And the replay, of course, presented by Kia. What a play. Rushed with the block. And it's out of bounds. The Cavalier is able to retain possession here. Some changes for Golden State. Thompson comes in for Ian Clark. And Curry subbed in for Sean Livingston. Tristan Thompson, he's checked in for Cleveland. We're just over two and a half minutes into the second quarter. Back to Irving. Traps in the tray. Irving's got six points. You know, what you love about Kyrie is that he's always prepared to shoot when he is roaming in space. Thompson outside. Outside for Curry. Just five on the clock. Golden State moving it around. The shot's good on the assist by West. Curry's got the lead up to eight now for the Warriors. The rapid fire threes coming from everywhere. Boy, both teams really attacking from downtown right now. This is a long range battle at the moment. To the inside, stolen by Thompson. West dishes to Durant. And the bucket counts. And he's on his way to the free throw line. Try to make it a three point play. The fact that he really was unfazed by that scoreless first quarter, and now you can see him getting into a rhythm. And the Warriors with some changes. Pachulia, he's checked in for West, and it's Green and for Andre Iguodala. Cleveland also making some changes. Braun, he's checked in for Fry. Jefferson comes in for Dunleap, and Smith subbed in for Shumpert. Doris, just taking a look now at the players in the game, past and present. Who is or was the most exciting player for you to watch? Boy, that, that's a lot. I mean, there's so many names, Kevin. I think Michael Jordan, uh, because when it became a possession ball game down the stretch, everybody in the gym knew Michael was going to find a way to the basketball. Uh, I love the Showtime Lakers, so watching Magic run the break with James Worthy, that kind of extraordinary athlete out there. And in today's game, I don't know how you can not admire LeBron James. And that's how we play the game. Bring it in. Let's go. Steph Curry. Mm -hmm. This guy is changing the very definition of what is being defined as a quality shot. And I think Steph is going to change the next generation of basketball players. What are they doing? What are they seeing? What they do now, you know, translate into how the game is, in your words, going to change? Well, I think, obviously, you know, you, we see that dynamic uh, pregame warm-up for Steph Curry where he's dribbling two balls and he's doing all sorts of magical things. And I think you could look at any playground around the United States or any practice at this point. Point, and you're going to see generation, a full generation of players now thinking 35-foot shots are the norm. I'm going to step across half court now, and I'm going to be able to shoot it with that kind of range. Uh, and to have the ability to make shots with defenders draped all over you, sometimes Steph doesn't look at the rim. Mm -hmm. When he's taking those shots, you sit there and go, he wasn't looking. How did he make that shot? <laughs> Extraordinary. And keeping us updated from the sideline, let's swing it over to David Aldridge. LeBron James has stepped up over the years, both on and off the court. Of course, he plays with that reckless abandon, but off the floor, he's been very involved and vocal about social issues. And more dramatically, he entrusted his marketing empire to his childhood friends.